You are now checking out the Fin for Time Make Show with DJ S. Swift and Miss Styles, only on Hip Hop Nation. The, the beard is distinctive, it's unique. Is there a message behind it or you just grown it out? The beard started because um, basically I wanted to have something grow with me as my career grew. Okay. Mm-hmm. So um, just something that I can visualize and grow. Um, it, it's also kind of like that measuring stick, like when I'm going through tough times, I can kind of see it breaking off and being scraggly. And then when I'm going through good times, it's full, healthy. So it's, it's kind of like something that I can see. Like, you know, um, I guess some people grow dreads that way, right? Yeah, it's yeah. a signature of growth. Right. Seeing how far I've come. Yeah. I can, okay, I can relate now. Yeah, so that's what the beard is. And it's Muslim, I'm Muslim, so okay. it's also a religious thing, too. So. It's a religious yeah. thing. I can respect that. The new project is out, Savage yes. Journey to the American Dream. Yes, please get that. Live mixtapes, stally330.com. And just anywhere, all the blogs got it. I mean, it's everywhere. It's in your face. Just Google it. Give them one reason why they must ASAP <coughs> get that project. Oh, man, because it's, it's for me. It's Stally. It's MMG, the newest member of MMG. And it's a classic. Like, it's the best mixtape out right now. What's the best advice what's been giving you so far? Oh, man. Like, just something simple. He always told me, like, you know, people can say what they want to say. They can hate. They can tell you what they, they can try to stop whatever they're trying to stop for your growth or whatever it is but he always tells me like no one or nothing can stop what god has for you mm. and that's just the best Powerful. advice you know what i mean yeah i so. agree tell us about this blue collar gang yeah blue collar gang is a movement it's uh for people like you know us right here sitting there it's for everyday hard-working individuals who you know be on that grind whether it's a nine to five whether it's school whether it's um you know music whatever it is you know we all come from uh being self-made individuals and we all come from you know i come from a small town myself <coughs> excuse me where everybody is kind of like uh there's a lot of family uh owned businesses and there's a lot of uh self-made individuals just mm-hmm. people doing whatever they got to do and um you know that's what it is i represent for everybody like myself when well, you get up out of here you know i'm, I'm i don't know if you tell i'm the kind of personal one mm-hmm. i try to get all up in your business right. can you tell me a secret that you uh, never told anybody else on any interview ever in your life you need to know, like, right, right now. I read a lot. I really? guess I'm a little What's the last book you read? Mm-hmm. I read... I'm still reading it, actually. <laughs> 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 it's called Durham Bums by Jack Kerouac. I've been reading that book for a while now. I feel bad. It's nice. Shame, See, shame rappers now. do read. You know, you know, rappers I don't, do I don't have read. a lot of time so, lately, so I've been, you know, reading that book for a while. But I'm going to finish it. Okay. What's the music? It's 